Oh, these are extreme lows? Mm -hmm. He came up to see our legs. He came up, we don't want no more if I talk to you. I keep it, yeah, take it. All right, say no more. Yeah. What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to the vlog. As you can see, we're gonna go and change out the springs. So I'm gonna get these Swift springs, they're 26K. And we're just gonna install them and see how the car feels after that. We got it right here. 26K. Short as hell. Yo, look at this shit. See the... Oh, it's not gonna lick. Just about, bro. Same height. Definitely the spring is way smaller. Engine bay looking pretty good. Gotta change this though. It's looking kind of weird. All right, we got it all done. That's how she sits. And the back is maxed out, so I have to adjust the bolt, cut it in order to bring this a little lower. So it's back to this, the height that I had it before I lowered it again. The front is a little bit lower, not too much. Looks good. Definitely stiffer, more stable. what we're gonna do today headliner I'll do this one too so we already got the swift springs in the front and in the rear um, so I gotta lower the back a little bit because it sits too high with the fitment that I had before uh, and that was the whole purpose of putting the swift spring so that it could be a lot stiffer. I'm gonna try to do the uh, headliner here and the pillars. We're gonna do them red to give it a, a nice accent with the rug and the shifter. Manichi sent me a, a text that they're gonna resend me a new rear mat because uh, as you can see they did like a little error here. So they're gonna be sending that out to me. If anyone's interested in this rear one you know let me know i'll sell it to you for the low but that's only the rear it's hot out here all right guys so we're gonna have to remove the pillars and i've never removed this so i'm gonna have to kind of figure out how to remove i know we have to remove this there's two bolts uh I believe up here yeah there's some screws up here one here one here but uh let's just get started with this removing the pillar pop it out that 
That one you can just twist off. That's the twisty. So. Yeah, twist it. Then I pull it down. Oh yeah, there's a bolt, there's a bolt, there's a bolt. Oh, oh yeah. you lucky then, yeah. dude. Oh my god. <laughs> Yours didn't have a bolt? Nah, I gotta push some little clip. I gotta push it in and then turn the wires and then it comes loose. Oh shit. Alright, so yeah, you take this cover off and there's two screws here. We're gonna take that out. They look like torques. Yeah, this they torques. Well you could use a flathead. Flathead, turn it. It comes right off. Alright, once you got it out, you're gonna see this. This is for the uh, LED. You just take it out. It comes right off. Alright, next we got this. We got two eight millimeter bolts in there. Two eight mils. Take these out. He already got his whole half front already out. I'm still here. I remove these in order to get this from being tucked. Remove that. I think this is ready to come down. All right. Headliner is finally out. Look at my hands. But we're finished. And it looks good. We just gotta do the pillars and then install it back in, put everything back, and it should look should look good. And just get the other pieces and you know wrap those. Alright, we got the Headliner in. So, yeah, it's a freaking mess here. But we're gonna take care of that once we're done. All right, guys, and just like that, we have the headliner done. This was really a mission. Um, it's, it's really, it's really time consuming to do, but it's definitely worth it. Uh, I'm gonna end the video here. We got a lot of good things in store for the channel. So if you're new here, make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe. You know, all that good stuff to help the channel out. Hope you guys like the video. I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.